Hey guys, I'm back from Pokemon Shining Pearl. It's me, Justin Gamer Dude, and this video I'm gonna, I'm still gonna defeat Brian, the gym leader. All right, use Whirlpool. It's not gonna help me. All right, good. And the sandstorm stopped. Hang on, guys. I gotta do something fast. Yep, hyper potion. Really. Whirlpool. Ah, finally. Bro, uh oh. You made me stop me this time, but you just call my whirlpool first. Alright, Bastodon, you're up next. Hold on, guys. I gotta revive my Empoleon first. Not cool. Use Rock Smash. Oh no, this this can't be happening. No, fast to dawn. All right, get him, Polyon. Use whirlpool. Yeah, that'll teach you a lesson for defeating two of my teammates. Anyway, Steelix is unable to battle and Polyon's the winner. Yeah, take that, Rock Snake. What's this? My last one. This is where we make our stand. Oh yeah? Really? Huh. It seems you have a bastard done just like I do. Alright, super potion, go. Heh. <laughs> Sorry, not feeling it. Alright guys, I think I might want to revive my Bastiodon first. Still not feeling it. Use Bubble Beam. Say cheese, dude. Use Aqua Jet. Heh, <laughs> sorry. Don't feel it. Not feeling it still. We're not done yet, there's no giving up. Oh, really? Empoleon, use Whirlpool now. Or not. Use Whirlpool. Are you kidding me? I'm 
I'm still standing, you know. Besides, it's not polite to thunder at someone. Sure, dude. Real mature. Whirlpool. Let's see if you like this. Yeah, let's play slip and slide, and you're the slide. Nice try. Whirlpool. Ah, well, that's the end of that. Fast Day Dawn is unable to battle. Empoleon is the winner, and that means the victor is just the challenger. Alright, all geared up. Nice. Nice to you again, Byron. Hmm, my sturdy Pokemon defeated. You got 4,836 for winning. Aw, thanks. You were strong enough to take down my prize team of Pokemon in recognition of that power. I give you this, the mind badge. All right, really? Thanks. Six down, two to go. Mind badge. I just got the mind badge. Having the mind badge enables you to use the hidden move strength from your Poketag anytime. You now have six gym badges. That means all Pokemon upon to level 70 will obey you without question. Here, take these two. Yeah, the stickers and the TM's moves, got it. TM 9-1's. Contains the move Flash Cannon? Huh. That's rad. Alright guys, I'm gonna get out of here. Like, time to make my way through. Was in steel type gym. You again? Hey, that's the mind badge. Good going. You're even tough enough to take a shot at becoming the Pokemon champion. Of course, I'm tougher, so that's not actually going to be going to happen. Anyways, Justin, come with me to the library. All right, guys. I just defeated the gym leader Byron, the steel type. Before I head to the library, I gotta go to the Pokemon Center first to heal my team. Now that you already saw Empoleon and Bastiodon battle. Alright, library it is. Here we go again. Hey Justin, over here, this way. Alright, you lead the way, Ralph. Whoa, Don Professor Rowan, what are you guys doing here? Okay, Gramps, I bought a dozen like I said. And now I'm out of here. Oh, not so fast, dude. Okay, I get it. Hmm. Everyone's finally here. Listen up. You may have forgotten already, but I study the evolution of Pokemon. The more I study, the more my mysteries appear and multiply. There are some Pokemon that evolve and others that don't. What makes them different from each other? Do immature ones evolve into ones that are more mature? If so, what do we make of the legendary Pokemon that don't evolve? Are we to assume that the legendary Pokemon of Sinnoh are complete as creatures? This is where you three come in. There is said to be a mysterious Pokemon in each of the three lakes of Sinnoh. If we can update data on them, 
it may shed the, some light on how the process of Pokemon evolution works. I need help from each one of you on this grant undertaking. Help me find these mysterious Pokemon. What are you saying? I didn't get a Pokedex. And who was it that bolted from the lab before I had a chance to give them one? But that's water under the bridge. Seeing a Pokemon with your own eyes is important for you to becoming a better trainer too. You can count on me. It will help me my Pokedex too. Justin, you'll go too, won't you? Of course. Hmm, I would have made all of you so go regardless. Now then, there are three legs. Fortunately, three three of you you should split up and investigate the lakes individually. Don, you go to Lake Verity. Will do. Ralph, I want you to investigate Lake Acuity. That would take you almost to Snow Point City. The road there is harsh. I need a tough trainer to go. Yeah, of course, Gramps. You know how to call it. You could tell on the hotness. And that leaves Justin with Lake Valor. The lake is between Beostone and Pastoria if memory serves. Wow, what the... What? Has it stopped? Are all of you unharmed? Of course not. Let's go outside, but be careful. I'm concerned about the city. Justin, hurry along, but beware of aftershocks. Alright, yes sir. Now that your meeting is over. Wow, that tremor, that wasn't a natural occurrence. Wow, who are you? Do I know you? Hey, hey old dude and kid, something big just happened. They're saying there was a huge explosion at Lake Valor. Kaboom! Like that. Well, that goes a bust. Gramps, I'm going to the lake. I have a bad feeling about this. Hmm, that Ralph can't stand still. Sit still. I'm worried about the Lake Valor. However, I have no idea what is taking place. You must find out. But before you go, I can't stress this enough. Don't get in over your head. We will try to join you as soon as we can expect Lake Verity. You'll be okay, won't you, Justin? Of course, Don. Alright, guys. It seems I'm gonna stop right there for the night, but... Thanks, guys, for watching me defeat Byron, the Steel-type Gym Leader, and now I have six Gym Badges. So I will continue this another time. So, thanks for watching this video, guys. Please like, comment, subscribe to my channel, Some Gamer Dude. See you guys in the next video. Bye. I'll wave the Zen.